is it? You tell me. Probably not. I can't. I can't see a clock. Anyway, Thames Path. Welcome to another episode of Toby Stupid Vlog. Still recovering from last night slightly. We found a Zumba picture we came to find. And I can head back because it's quite cold. Bunk. We're going into the cold. We're going to Winter Wonderland. It's the plan and hopefully the um, drunk twins will make it and they won't be too hungover. It doesn't look that cold, but it is. I can assure you. Yeah, made it. Now I just got to find everyone, which would be probably impossible. Here we are, somewhere, trying to play find find the people, uh, but the mobile signal is rubbish. And there's a few people here, including some really stupid people. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they, it's a continuing theme, I think. Terry's been sick multiple times today, so that's going well. Personal best of 10. And Lindsay's considering going on that. Yeah. So, Ashley and Lindsay have gone on that which looks really harmless, but you just know it's going to be evil. Concerned at this distance, Lindsay's sick might actually hear me. <laughs> Lindsay looks like she's been put in a tumble dryer, so that's a good sign. I'm not even joking, my seat came undone. My, <laughs> seat, my, my seat went click, click, click. The made this making noise, we thought you were going to die. <laughs> I was yeah, like, I was holding on. Funny. And, went, <laughs> and I looked at my street compared to hers and I was like, hanging out more. Oh, Not good. That's great. <laughs> I mean, that's more my level, but still, it's a bit excessive. It's hilarious. <laughs> See your dinner. Finally, we're in. fucking hours later. Lindsay wanted to get a crepe, only it was that was an hour ago. There was some fella, he wanted like ten of them. Like his mum, his sister, his kids. I was like, see what? That better be the most amazing crepe ever. I just got to sit down gob. Hey? No, I want to see this. <laughs> and with dignity. Get in your gob. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Sunday shopping. The wonder that is Westfield. One of the Westfields, I should say. There's now another one. 
in Stratford. Where you can buy everything. Ice cream. Like ice cream. <laughs> and Krispy Kremes. I mean, it's all the cream, cream products you ever need. Some good HP branding there. Westfield Ice Rink. <coughs> So we've done we've done a bit of shopping. That's where Santa lives. That's Santa's snow dome. It's not that popular. The elves are looking a bit flustered, to be honest. Like Santa's busy. Go away. And we've been <laughs> we've been at Westfield so long. The sunset. <laughs> oh well. They are crazy lazy. Oh no, Toby's. Well, I won't, I won't be able to video anything later because I'll be all NDA'd up to the eyeballs, won't I? Yeah. No, 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 we are videoing. Yeah. No, we won't be NDA'd. I'll be able... Um, yeah. Good, good worksmanship there, everyone. Congratulations. That is a Polish piece, sorry, Polish piece of work. Yes. Not what I did there. So, we just went to... Uh, the Talent Cow launch last night. So we'll have a bit of a chat with Neil in a sec. Just thought I'd give you a tree update in the meantime. Um, here we go. Bit of focusing required. There you are. Think of a scale. Two Christmas trees. Baubles to come. It's time for another towpath walk. As you might have realised, because I do these every ten days or so, it's because I like it. And, uh, I mean, it's good fresh air, and usually you get in, you've been on the tube all morning, and you feel the. This kind of makes you feel a bit more awake. Which has got to be a benefit, especially in my case. So, that's what happens. Now, the problem is now that the sun is rising increasingly late, so it's only just up when I start off. And it is a little cold, but, you know, as long as it's not pouring with rain, Still lovely. So that's what's going to happen. And next time we speak, I might even be awake. So watch out for that. You see the massive black bird on the pole. It might not look too big to you. Trust me, he is. He's got a wingspan of about six feet. He is a cormorant. They're seabirds generally. I love a good bit of fish. He's chilling today. There's the Budweiser factory, all its hoppy glory. And we're walking towards the sun. So, you know, put your glasses on. Oh, I've got my sunglasses on, so I look cool. And also why I'm not blind. Look at that. I happen to think winter's going rather well. Now, it will definitely all go to crap on Saturday because that's when I'm trying to leave the country and in fact the whole of Europe will most likely go to crap on Saturday. But, um, you know, make the most of it while you can. Envious yet? Bet you are if you're stuck in an office. Check out this idiot. He's cycling at walking pace, which kind of defeats the purpose. I was trying to do a business deal on his phone. No, it's not cool. Trust me, it ain't cool. Anyway, so, um, I'm off to Bavaria on Saturday. Crystal's off to New Zealand on Friday. Um, and you get to come along and see the wonder that is Bavaria. Hopefully there may even be some New Zealand footage at some point, but um, I... There being patchy internet, I can't see that happening imminently. Anyway, um, I just thought you might want to. This is where I'm going. Let me let me just show you. So that's a current the current webcam of the area, and it looks very nice. What are the chances there'll be snow by the second of December? What do you reckon? Anywho, there's a Hammersmith Bridge. So I'm pretty much there, uh, which means I've got to go to work now. Boo! You're already at work, so I don't know why. Know, why you're hating. Anyway, um, let's uh, let's cut forward in the day a bit to Mr. Bentley. Heart Studio Magnificence <laughs> with Kirsty's decorating the room, as you can, can I see. Do the other ones, please? 
Um, Make yourself busy. Come okay. on, Oh. <laughs> I just threw that on the floor, that's not helpful. Um, but we have snow and can we say, have diagonal things. But uh, Kirsty being up on a table like that reminds me of the first time we met. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not getting down there again. Oh, <laughs> I don't think she got it. <laughs> yeah, she did. That's right, if you're watching this video thinking, is that Magnum P.I.? <laughs> then it is. Or Hitler. <laughs> it's, it's Hitler. It's Hitler. <laughs> Lovely. I thought I'd give you a final tour of this magnificent um, what festivity, I guess, is the word. Um, no. There's bells and there's stars and there's Christmas messages and lights and snow and there's a Neil Bentley. Yeah. I'm not very good. <laughs> you're not I'm, very... Sucking, I'm sucking on a scrapsaw. Neil's been talking too much because he was talking a lot last night and now he has a sore throat. No, I don't have a sore throat. I'm, I feel like I've been run over by a cow. Yeah, <laughs> it's because you have been run over by a metaphorical cow. Hmm. Yeah. Happy Christmas. Thanks. Um, so there we go. Uh, update from Neil there. Not telling you anything because it's a secret. Just look out for a cow. Um, so I bought a new t-shirt. Well, a couple of new t-shirts, in fact. And nobody's made any comment. And it turns out it's because nobody knows what it means. Uh, which I'm very disappointed in. Let's see if I can show you. It's that. Hang on. Reunite Pangea. Now everyone's looking at me like, what the hell does that mean? And it turns out it's because nobody knows what Pangea is. Which is ridiculous, to be honest. Um, right. Uh, Pangea, just in case for those that don't know, was the original continent. when every, Before continental drift happened, when all the land masses on the planet were one, back millions of years ago, uh, more than that in fact, um, there there was one landmass and it was called Pangaea. See it's hilarious, reunite Pangaea. It's like a t-shirt um, that's making comment on, you know, like a band getting back together and it's, never mind. Um, <laughs> anyway, the, the reason I know, the, the, you should know that is because knowledge is king. And you know how I know knowledge is king? Because I've got that written on another t-shirt. Here we go, so you can find it. There we go, knowledge is king. See, that's a vintage Stussy t-shirt from the 90s. It's written on t-shirt, so it is true. So check out, you know, learn some, learn some damn facts already. Check out Wikipedia, Pangea. You heard it here first, most likely. That's the last call I've got you have to take it off me. <laughs> king of hearts. <laughs> this is the new uh, heart office furniture. It's quite small, but then Chloe's pretty tiny, so look, that's... That's a normal pack of cards. Yeah. Uh, so it doesn't actually fit on the... <laughs> this is what a sensible person might call too early, but um, a sensible person is not me. Um, it's about half seven. Now, I know a lot of you probably get up at this time anyway, um, but I don't start work usually till ten, so I don't. Um, and Crystal and Debbie are just off to New Zealand at the moment. There's a nice cab man waiting for them. And they're going for a couple of weeks. In fact, they're back on the what turns out to be the morning of the 17th of December, so that's a while. Um, which is odd, because I've only just got used to, you know, actually living with someone again, and now I'm not going to be for a few days. So uh, a readjustment will be required, and this place will probably be a complete tip. So <laughs> I'll have to, uh, I'll have to actually give it a bit. It is a tip. That's why I'm not showing it to you, because um, obviously I'm going off on holiday tomorrow as well. Um, so overlapping holidays is always a good plan. And then when I get back, it'll still be a while because <laughs> I get back on Wednesday, and they get back two weeks on Saturday. Um, but uh, yeah, they should have a great time. We'll see lots of photos when I get back. And I might go back to bed in a mo now. Hello, good evening. Um, it is the end of the week. Um, I didn't manage to film Rick's near nervous breakdown, so that's that's disappointing. Not for not for Rick. Um, and I'm off on holiday tomorrow. In fact, it is currently ten o'clock. I'm off on holiday in eight hours, so I should go to bed. Although I should also finish packing. Um, I'm not going to show you the case because it's too humiliating. But suffice to say, it will have been finished by the time you watch this. Or else I really am in trouble. Um, so, uh, see, you, see you later. In fact, see you in Germany. <laughs>